Hi, and welcome back. Today we will be visiting the Miami-Dade County Public Schools Parent Portal. I'll be showing you how to create an account if you don't already have one, how to log into the account, and what features are available to parents once you're logged in. So let's take a look together. First, you will go to dadeschools.net. Next, you will click on Parents. Come down here and you can either log in to your existing account or create an account. Let's create an account. First, you'll need to agree to the policies by clicking on I agree. And next. In this window, you will need to enter your information. So type in your first name, middle name or initial if you have one, your last name, and you'll have to create a password that is exactly eight characters. It cannot be less than eight, it cannot be more than eight. You can include special characters and numbers and capital letters if you wish. You will write the password in this box and write the same password again in this box. Next, you will include your email address if you already have one, or you can choose to click here and ask that Miami-Dade County Public Schools provide an email account for you. Scroll down a little further and you'll need to enter these letters to authenticate your account. And next click on register. Once you have completed this process, you will receive a pop-up window that states that you have received an email where you will go and confirm your account and then you'll be able to log in. Once you have that information, you'll be able to return to the main page where you log in. We're going to do that by clicking here on Parents. And here we are once more. So let's log in. Enter your username and password and click on Login. And this is the home page for the Parent Portal. Here you will notice that it looks very similar to the Student Portal. There are alerts here which notify you about different things that you can either apply for or just simple information. You have your personal information, which you can click here to update. You have the electronic gradebook, which you can access by clicking here, and you can view your children's grades and attendance records. And you also have the option, let's scroll down, to add and remove students from the gradebook that you are able to see here. So if you have students that you need to add, you can add them here. If you have students that have graduated and perhaps you don't want to see uh, show up in your list of students or children, you would click here to remove them. You also have the choice here to go paperless. So for the purposes of receiving your report cards and progress reports um, through the parent portal or just viewing them through the parent portal, you can click here and you will no longer receive printed copies of the report cards or progress reports from school. You would only access that information through the parent portal. Under registered students, you'll notice each of the children you have added to your parent account. To view your child's grades, you'll have to click on their individual links. Once you're in the app, you can switch between one student and the other. A little further down in the Parent Portal homepage, you'll find parent news and events. These are different events with discounts and promotions that may be available to parents with children in Miami-Dade County Public Schools. Now let's scroll up to look at the Apps and Sites link. And we'll click here to go there. In App Services and Sites, you'll find many different apps that teachers may ask you to access for different reasons. Today I'd like to show you about one particular app that is very useful to parents, and that is PayPams. This app allows you to create an account for your child where you can add funds for lunch. This means your child won't have to take lunch money to school anymore. They simply type in their ID when they're in the cafeteria, and this will deduct the funds right from their PayPams account. Take some time to look at the different apps and explore. There are many that may be useful to you. And that concludes our tour of the Parent Portal for Miami-Dade County Public Schools. If you have any questions, remember you can always type them below. Thanks for joining me and see you next time.